in order to work with different branches, we need the following commands. If you just type git branch, you will get a list of what branches are available in your repository. Um, you can also start a new branch uh, by either saying git branch and then the name of the new branch, then the new branch will start uh, at where you're currently of the, the head of your current branch. Uh, or you can explicitly give a start point. You can say git branch, what's the name of the branch and which commit should it start from. And then you can switch your entire working directory to operate on a different branch. So the content of the, if you type git switch branch name, the content of the working directory um, will be updated to have the content of the head of that branch and your head ref will point to this new branch reg and any subsequent commits that you make from then on uh, will uh, now be added to the branch to which you have switched. Uh, you can combine the creation of a new branch and switching to it into a single switch command with switch minus c where you create a new branch name. And if you want to merge a command, uh, a branch back into another branch, then uh, you have to switch to the branch on which you want the, com the merge to happen. And then you just state which other commit. Uh, this can be, for example, a, a tag or a branch or just a, a hexadecimal uh, hash value. Uh, what do you want to merge back? So let's have a a look at an actual example of doing this in our terminal here. Um, so if I type the, oops, if I type the uh, branch command, then it will show me at the moment I have only a single branch, which is still using the old fashioned master name. The version here I have hasn't switched to main yet. And now we create a new branch, uh, git branch updates 1.0. And we want to start from release 1.0 as I've shown previously in the diagram. We want a separate branch where we have all the bug fixes that we apply to release 1.0 recorded outside the main development line. And then we can git switch to updates 1.0 and uh, now the corporate lawyers have reminded us of a serious bug. Namely, there was no copyright message. So we add one um, copyright and I forgot what the current date is. So I just ask the date command to please insert the current year here. and that we append to file one. Um, that has worked, it has appended the copyright message. So we can now make a commit, git commit. We add anything that has been changed. copyright notice added. And now we can switch back to master. And on master, there is no copyright message yet. Can we get this back? Yes, we just have to type git merge Everything that has happened since on the updates 1.0 branch, we can merge back. And 
oh i forgot the merge actually also requires a message uh, and it popped up an editor which you couldn't see and so on we can go back git switch updates 1.0 make another little edit and do another commit and then to show you how we can have a uh, merges from two sides we can git switch back to master and without uh, first merging i'll make here a change for example i want to have an exclamation mark here and i make also a commit that indicates day became day. And if I want to now see where I am, I can do this on the console here with git log and I want the graph output. I want to see all the branches and you can see it is able to produce this little ascii art where you can see this was our original commit this here was release one and then we forked off here this here is the um, the updates branch and we have added the copyright notice and we've changed here nice into very nice but we also have the mainline branch where we have changed world into humans where we have changed our first copyright notice fix back this here was the merge the merge turned into another commit automatically and then we have made another commit here this is all fine in in ascii art but it is in fact uh, there are nicer tools available um, in particular there is a tool called git k available that has a graphical user interface for browsing the uh, revision graph of your repository and here you can see uh, the same revision history uh, the blue dots are the commits the yellow dot is the commit uh, the head commit of the current working directory we can see here this is the master branch the green uh, boxes are branch refs and the yellow boxes here are the tag refs. In addition, you can see here the metadata associated with the commit. So we have currently selected with this gray cursor here the merge branch and you can see um, this branch has a single child, namely the current master branch, but it has two parents. This is uh, what happens in a merge and you can see here the references to the two different parents and if you click on any um, commit here you can see the diffs associated with the commit and you can see on the side here the list of files that had been modified in this commit it's a very practical tool git k to quickly get an overview what the status of your repository is and if you call only git k you will only see um, the current branch that you are on but if you call git k uh, with option hyphen hyphen all then it will show you all the branches that are available on the repository